Hello everyone, this is me, Sabia here, and I'm back with the first week of uh, November reads, stuff from the 1st through the 7th of November 2023. This reading is going to be for the sign of Leo, so le let's see what's coming in for Leo for this uh, first week of November time. I will be adding messages from your person as well, so stay tuned, and before I dive into the read, let me remind you, it's a general reading. It may not, may not resonate with everyone out there, pick whatever resonates and leave the rest. For personal reads, you can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can also check out other services that I offer as well in the description box. So let's see what's coming in for Leos for this week time. What's coming in for Leos? Let's begin. Knight of Wands, the Sun, the Empress. Wow. Knight of Pentacles, Page of Cups, Seven of Cups on the deck. We do have King of Swords. Wow. I really feel like, you know, there there is someone in your life right now who is probably um, interested in you. This person can be somebody who is... Um, who's slightly older than you to be honest but at the same time i really feel like you know this person really wants this connection to work with you now it can be somebody at your work front it can be your boss it can be your colleague it can be somebody who you believe is like not the right match for some reasons um there might be cultural or religion uh, differences as well for some of you but i really feel like you know this person has been showing a lot of interest in you lately and i really feel like you know in this week time as well this person will be taking some steps towards you to show you that, yes, they are involved or they are interested in you. Now, it can be a friend as well. It can be a new person as well. But this person is somebody who is going to add a lot of fun in your life. This person is going to be somebody who is going to be um, bringing you a lot of happiness and joyful moments together. Having said that, I really feel like you know, because of the way things are and the way probably the differences are between you and this person, like cultural or all those things, Maybe the age difference would be the thing, but there is going to be something which is going to turn you off around this person. Even though you would know that this person loves you a lot and they are interested in you and they are willing to take things forward with you, you will be showing your attitude to this person. You would be having kind of a cold attitude towards them. I really feel like, you know, um, for majority of you, maybe you are going to doubt or fear that, you know, this person might not take things forward with you. So maybe they want to pass time with you and that's the reason why you're going to be like, ah, oh, I don't know if I'm, I want to work it out or not with this person. I really feel like you will be having your guards up against this person, but whoever this person is, even if it's an ex returning back to you, this person is intending to have a future with you, but the way they are coming across, I feel like, you know, you will have your concerns, you will have your doubts. For some of you, I really feel like you are going to be getting indecisive. You're going to be thinking about it. You're going to be thinking about the offer that they are going to be making towards you. But at the same time, you are so unsure. Shall you give this person a chance or shall you just like, you know, um, ignore it? But I really see you way cold towards this person, whoever it is. The energies could be reversed for some of you, but if it's you who is ignoring this person, I really feel like you know, you're going to give it a thought. You're going to give it a try. Um, you're gonna think like, you know, okay, let me see if I could work it out or not But I really feel like, you know, you are going to get drawn to this person a lot as well So I really feel like, you know, whoever this person is You will be definitely having a good time with this person Which is going to make you feel like maybe this can be this can work out For sure it's gonna be your, you know, theme for the first week time I really feel like, you know, whoever this person is You're gonna feel like you're on the same page with this person even though there will be like age difference or some differences like that, but you are going to feel like, you know, this person seems cool. Um, even if it's a past person returning, they are going to be returning to you um, as a different person. So even if they are coming back from the past, they are going to be more open. They are going to be more vocal. They are going to be like more into you. So I really see that this person is definitely revealing their feelings to you as well as they are showing you their intention as well with their attitude. Now, the only thing I see here is you being indecisive, but in this week time, you're definitely going to give it a try, give it a chance as well. Let's see what else is happening for you in this week time. What else is coming in for you in this week time? I really feel like, you know, for some of you, you're going to feel like you have been through a lot. 
So you really don't want to be in into any relationship which is not fulfilling or satisfying at all. I feel like you, know, you will have your guards off until unless you feel that you know this person is ready to give you something solid and stable. Um, I really feel like you've been through a lot and you really don't want to deal with shit again. For some of you could be dealing with a Scorpio or this person can be a Scorpio who's coming towards you. So you would have your concerns. But um, I feel like, you know, for some of you, there might be financial differences, which could be the reason too. And um, I really feel like, you know, whatever the case is, um, the issues are definitely resolvable. And I feel like, you know, you will be able to make things work in this connection if you... Um, you know, um, think about things. I really feel like you know a lot is going to get revealed to you. Um, there will be a lot of thought process going on during this week time. I really feel that you, you know, for a majority of you, you are definitely going to be thinking about this offer, and uh, in this week time, um, you would start seeing things from a different perspective around this person and this connection. Let's see the um, messages from your person. Whoever it is that you're dealing with, whoever it is that is coming for you, what are their messages right now? I miss the feel of you next to me. If this is a past person, this, really, this person really miss you a lot. I love the way you love me. It feels so right. I choose to walk away or stay silent, but I'm badly affected. So for some of you, this person is somebody who, um, who has been in love with you, uh, but maybe things were not working well for the two of you. I am finally realizing where I made a mistake. So if there has been some sort of clash between the two of you, things are going to get resolved. My mind and heart brings me back to you. I can now feel what I made you go through. So for some of you, I really feel like you know, it's the return of a past person. But even then, this person has been thinking a lot about you and really want to make make a move towards you. Now, I really feel like you know this person has always been um, bothered with whatever went into this connection, like, you know, um, fights, arguments, disagreements, patch up, break up, whatever. I really feel like, you know, your person um, now realizes the worth of this connection and really want to make this work, which is going to be the reason why they are like, you know, putting effort and showing you that they want it. They want this connection for real. But at the same time, you are not going to be like so sure of this um, until unless you see uh, the, the confirmation um, by their actions and in this connection. Let's see what else is happening for you during this week time. I really feel like, you know, for majority of you, this week is the time where probably you can see things very clearly. And, uh, you know, if you want, you can definitely make a choice. But I really don't see you making a choice around this person. You are rather going to surrender to the divine and believe in the divine timing. For some of you, uh, I really feel like you could be dealing with the Sagittarius or a Taurus as well. Um, but yes, I really see the good thing here is you are surrendering. You're not making uh, any conclusion around this person and the connection right now. You're going to give it a, some time and see where it goes. But definitely, you will start seeing that prosperity lies ahead in this connection. So you probably start giving into the connection to them. Let's see the last few cards of the read for this week time. What else is happening for you during this week? Accepting challenges, trust your inner resources, and move forward. Experience the grace of who you truly are. I really feel like, you know, yes, there might be some challenges that you have to deal with when it comes to this person. I feel like, you know, the challenges comes from the past. And I feel like, you know, um, you continue moving forward. You continue looking up to the future. And uh, things are going to get resolved. And even if there is something to do with the past which is holding you back, I really feel like you know, you're going to be like giving it time. You are going to be like thinking through things and which is going to make you open your heart up to their love and their offer. And because you are going to have that um, good time spent with this person for sure. So yeah, that's uh, pretty much it coming up for you for this week time. If it was of help, do like, share and subscribe. If you are willing to purchase any of the services that I offer, check the description box. Till I do the next read, take care. Bye.